Okay dudes, what's up? What is happening? I have started this new world and I'm going to start a let's play series for for I would say I don't know what but average people I would guess. Oh it's definitely not for beginners. Put it that way. And I hope you enjoy it. I was searching around for seeds for about 10 20 minutes and I found this seed, it's really good, it spawns you night like right in front of a mountainous biome and this is a snow biome except it's not got any snow in it but once 1.9 comes out officially snow will come and we can get snow golems and all that fun stuff and also there's pumpkins right there which is really handy yeah this may be a bit boring to start off with i'm just going to do the basic stuff you know get the wood build the basic tools once i get the street on get the crafting tables and stuff out it when there's it's that one piece of wood left which you can never get and why did I put two there? Oh, dick it out. I don't know why I whispered I, I do whisper I'm quite weird as a person yeah anyway so now I don't know that much about the 1.8 update as such like I mean I know a lot about it but I haven't experienced a lot of things like I've never been I don't know why I did that well actually no I do I better with the chest uh, I've never experienced any of the things like I've never been in a stronghold yet never done any of that stuff you know what I mean so this is mostly new to me and also th when the special update comes out there'll be like the whole alchemy things and so hopefully I'm going to try and keep this nice and fresh I'll deliberately try and stay away from all this stuff so that I will be natural surprises when I do it all like not saying I'm doing nothing like I will do research into it before I post a video about it but hopefully it will go well Anyways, I'll just get a little bit more wood and then I'll start building a basic house, get some stone, all that stuff. I don't think I do know there's pumpkins there. I will harvest them at some point. Uh, I think I have quite a good idea where to build the house. Well, I'm not going to start off with my main house. I'm going to build like this sort of little fort thing just so that, I, you know, I can um, build a really big house near it. <laughs> Hopefully it'll be good. I'm gonna try and keep these minutes like sort of short, ten to fifteen minute episodes. Probably in between ten to fifteen, because I like having ten minutes episodes as my thing. But then I have that five minutes to fall back on, so it's quite handy. Just trying to think. So I want to build over here. I'll show you quickly. I. I love the new sprinting, um, but no, you can't really see from this tree. Might as well just cut it down while I'm up here. I'll show you once I get this tree done. Then I promise we'll start building because I know this is quite boring to watch. But um, I know this probably will not get that many views because it's only my first ever video and it's not going to be amazing, let's be honest. So, but like, if you do watch it and you do like it and you want to see more, just give it a thumbs up, put a comment out, and I'll but try and report, or not report, read every day, new comments, but I doubt I'll ever get any. Ooh. There's some coal up over there. Get that quickly. And get the reeds. Oh, also, um. I might start doing some tutorials. Whoa, I'm sorry for that. Where's that coming from? Can you hear that? That's weird. No, I can't get that high. Just doing the first. Anyway, it's about midday. Once I get this, I better start building the house. 
it's really handy because like the days are 10 minutes on the like dot so when I know it's coming night I know I have to sort of start ending it then I have half of the night to get ready which is quite boring so I can easily end it within half the night that should be enough coal for now we don't we're not trying to get loads I know this where I was thinking about this whoa well he just fell into a ravine Weird. First contact. Midday. What about that? Anyway, I really like this waterfall. And I also thought this mountain over here looked really cool. Yes. Um, well. So I was thinking. That I could build my base almost into the mountain. Like into the two mountains. Do you know what I mean? If that pro probably was going to last good. Just by listening to it. I, in my head I thought this really good idea and I know what stones I'm going to build it out of I'm going to build it out of the new brick stone, wood, sandstone and leaves and stuff like that I'm really into now the leaf blocks as well well not really into them but I think they look really good for decoration and also I really like the new glass and iron blocks Okay, well, I think we should probably get building this house. Okay. Oh, I need food as well. Mm. In between parts one and two, you may just do quick sort of resource collection. Because you're not really going to be missing out on anything apart from me cutting down trees. What is. That's just wasting wood. I don't know why I'm doing that. Sorry. As I say, this isn't going to be the big house, it's just going to be a small basic house. And as you can tell, I'm very bad at this. It's going to be a small basic house. Not really much into it. Oh, I might do some adventure maps as well. That would be cool. Although what I really want to do is build an automatic wheat farm, or not wheat, um, wheat, reed, no, I thought I said wheat there, reed farm. <laughs> and if you don't know how to do that, they are actually, you know, I thanks to a person called Etho, um, he's a really good Minecraft person, he does loads of really cool tricks and ideas. I probably will be using a lot of his plans in this. But basically, he found a way that you can reset, like, w sort of water update things. They're called bud switches. And he's found a way how you can reset them so that it updates. I won't confuse you and bore you with this stuff. So I'll, you'll, you'll see later. Or check them out if you want to. I'd highly advise you to. He almost kind of inspired me to do this. Okay, there's our basic house. Sorry, it's quite, quite dark in here. Annoying YouTube lights. Or gamma. There you go. Now I better go out and get some stone. Which we have loads of. Die sheep. Die, 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 die. There you go. Very careful. Actually, monsters could easily spawn inside there. Ah, oh, it's getting near. Hit. Whoa, more lag. Oh, I only had three frames per second there. Oops, crazy. Hopefully, the lag won't be too much of an issue. I know it's happened twice already. I think. I'm not sure, it's really low. I was testing out, out like earlier on this morning and I was getting into like the 30 frames per second. For some reason, right now it's down to like 20. I'm not sure why. Hopefully, it's not going to be too much of an issue. Okay, there's me out. 
we better head back to our small hut, which looks really weird. I have a feeling this, this door should be on the other way. Anyway, yeah, that looks much better. Anyways, just make some of the basic tools. Actually, better make a furnace first of all. They're quite important now. You know, just to get the food thing started, because I'm already down to and a quarter food things. Okay. Let's make the basic tools. And the sword. Well, I might as well make two swords, actually. And then the chest. At some point I will make a big chest room. Don't even know why I have that anymore. But I'll keep it anyway. But yeah, hopefully I will make it so that there's a nice big one. And yeah, it's night. Okay, I'm going to end this episode here, guys. See you later. Bye.